Hi YouTube, it's Kiana coming at you with a very quick video. Um, and when I say quick, I mean quick because as you can see, I look very tired and I look a hot mess, okay? <laughs> anyway, um, I wanted to come to you with an update on T's hair. By the way, thank you for all, all uh, for the birthday, which is she was like, really excited and I read some to her. So, you know, she's really happy. She is the princess. So, yeah. Um, on my hair, and you know the background, I'm doing laundry, <laughs> which is why I'm so tired. Um, my hair is still that, um, lock loop set from last Sunday. Today is Sunday. So, um, it's been a week and I still have curls that are kind of holding and they're not going anywhere. So, yeah, um, the, um, Talia Wajid Crickles and Curls foam setting lotion stuff is the business okay um but now let's get to t's hair um obviously it's like 11 o'clock so it's late and she sleeps so i can't show you her hair but i will tell you what happened um i showed you on her birthday video her hair she just got twisted up so her lock journey well the place i took her to was bogus okay because i'm looking at her hair her hair as y'all saw was pulled back into a style it's pulled back in like some flat twists well five or six blacks so it's going back so it just looks really cute from the back and the front look cute or whatever um her hair was being pulled too tight i noticed so what i did was and if you see me looking up i'm looking at myself with a webcam um so when i undid it you know loosened it you know i think that fixed it but her hair was hard like hard and i just was like what is that because you Every time I get on YouTube, but this time I'm tired for real. But um, it was hard and crunchy, and I'm like, "What is that?" Because you know, with sister lash, you're not used to that. So um, Saturday, yesterday, rolls around, and I'm like, "Let me, you know, I'm taking her to get her hair retwisted." But I decided to go someplace else that's really popular in Newark, um, called Cut Creators, and Daniela Cut Creators is actually the one who retwisted her up yesterday. She did an awesome job. She retwisted my baby, she cut my son's hair, and they both look fantastic for, you know, their graduations this week. So happy. Anyway, um, well, I look really bad with no makeup on. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, so I take it out, the flat twist and everything to get ready to go to her appointment. And y'all, I just took pictures because y'all are not gonna believe it. She had locks that were small, she had locks that were big, she had locks that were medium. She did, nothing was uniform on her head. Let's just put it that way. Whatever you use in her hair made her scalp kind of break out. So her scalp was irritated a little bit. And like the twists that were in the flat, the locks that were in the flat twist were super greasy, super shiny, and super crunchy. So whatever he put in her hair to start her was bullish, okay? Pure bullish. And um, I took her cut creators and um the girl was washing her hair and she had to wash it three or four times to get all that nasty stuff out and there was still kind of some buildup in her hair so i was very upset so um danielle had to go through her hair and repart her entire hair some of them were good size and some of them she was like with the I mean, she was pissed off for me. And then she said, I bet you they just styled it and make it, made it look cute. And I said, that's exactly what they did. Because I didn't know it was all these discrepancies in her hair. That would have been a problem. And also, I was too busy conducting business on my phone while she was getting her hair done to look and notice what he was using in her hair, which is a mistake on my part. So, they washed her hair really good. And Danielle went through and reparted her hair. And when I say that when she took her from under the dryer and took all the clips out. I looked through her hair. She's like, it looks 10 times better, doesn't it? I was like, yes, it does. She looks fabulous. Her locks were uniformed all the way through her head. They were very pretty. She let me see every lock. I could see every part in her head. Do you hear me? Every part. Every lock is uniform. And then we, um, I had her style the hair up into two ponytails on the side of her hair. It is so cute. I'll put her on camera tomorrow, I think. Um, so y'all can see it but she looks so fabulous so this is my disclaimer to people who are going to get their children's lock starting you're not going to a sister lock lactation or if you are going to get sister locks for your children and you know what to go ahead and dispel why i didn't get sister locks for my daughter this is why ever since i got my hair done 
15, 16 months ago, my daughter said she wanted her to look like mommy. She wanted her to look like mommy. This has been over a year now. She said this. She just turned five. Let's keep in mind she's a little girl and little girls and children in general are indecisive about what they want for themselves. And our job as parents is to make the best decision. I said that if I'm going to lock her hair, which I have every intent of doing from the get-go, that I was not going to go to Sister Lock Rob because just in case she didn't like it or whatever reason she had, my money wouldn't go wasted as to where I can go start her off with comb coils. And if we don't like it or anything like that, you can wash her hair and be done with it. And that is my reason to go the traditional route versus the sister lock route with her hair. With my hair, I'm not going to waste my money that I just paid for a sister locks to comb all this stuff out. Some people do, some people don't. I'm not that one. I love my hair, my daughter's hair. It will look fabulous either way. And we're going to airlock them anyway, so whatever. Um, but my disclaimer is to research, 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 and pay attention to what people are doing. Because, you know, you trust people to do things and, you know, Things weren't done right. And then as I looked around the shop, I saw some things that were wrong. So like I told you in the last video, with where I work at, that's not going to fly. So I'm going to make sure that they get reported ASAP. And then my daughter's hair is messed up and her scalp was irritated. I'm more likely got to go to the doctor and get some medicated shampoo to make sure that her scalp is A-OK -okay because I don't even trust it. Um, Cut Creators did a fantastic job with my children. The wait was a little long, but they're a very busy shop. But I scheduled appointments in the mid-morning about 11 o'clock for her and 12 o'clock for my son. We didn't get out to about 4 because they didn't get seen until about 1 or 2 o'clock. Yeah, but other than that, it was fantastic because I took them when, because this day I will be maintaining Tiana's hair from now on. When I take her back, I'm going to go like 8 o'clock in the morning because that would be best for all of us that way if I have things to do I can and then the other people would like bring her back every two weeks to get retwisted I was like no we're not going to thin her out early on in the game um, my Damien quote <laughs> but um, Danielle was like you don't have to bring her back for six weeks I'm like really she's like yeah six weeks if you feel she needs a wash before then I already knew that with you know traditional lot you can't wash them right away she said, if you think she needs to wash before then, you can bring her back before then. But I don't need to see her for another six weeks if, um, if nothing goes, you know, awry or whatever. So I'm very grateful for people who do the right thing. And, you know, we're not just all about the money for all about the money. Because I have no problem dropping the money for my children when they need their stuff taken care of. Not a problem at all. So, um, yeah. That's T's lock update. Kind of sort of. I'll let her come on camera and talk about how she likes her hair and stuff. I bet you she'll love that. And she also got her nails painted, so she'll probably talk to you about her nails. My nails, if I didn't show them to you, are yellow with design. Yeah. And hers are that same color yellow, just all the way through with no designs on it because she's a little girl and she needs to look like a little girl. Um, what's up going on this week preschool graduation is wednesday for my baby she'll be graduating preschool going into kindergarten they call it a moving up ceremony here and my son's kindergarten graduation into first grade is on thursday so i'll be one proud mommy and i will be posting my stuff on instagram i'll be taking pictures on instagram if y'all want to follow me on instagram I'll leave that information below but it's just my first and my last name which i will leave it below and you need to um, let me know that some kind of way. I don't know how you can do that on Instagram. Let me know you're from my YouTube family so I accept you. Because if I don't know you, I'm not accepting you. Because I post private. My Instagram is private. And these are pictures of my children. And you see I very rarely put them on camera. And I really don't want the world. You know what I'm trying to say. So let me know you're from YouTube. And I will accept you. Also, uh, my Instagram is probably the same as my Facebook, but I'm not sure if I want to leave my Facebook open um, to YouTube yet. I'll figure that out. If y'all want to be part of my YouTube, you can private message me, or not YouTube, but my Facebook, you can private message me, and you know, we can go from there with that, because that's my family too. And there's a couple of people, because I'm in a social life group, that are actually subscribed to me, and I'm subscribed to them, and we're on Facebook together, so you know, it might not be too big of a deal, but you can never be sure, because there's some crazies out there. All right, y'all. I'm tired of looking at myself talking to you guys. I'm pretty sure you're tired of me looking at myself while I'm talking to you. And it's late and my mouth is not moving up to my face. I need to get my living room back in order because I cannot go to bed with it jacked up. <laughs>
but thanks for listening i appreciate it i know i look super 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 tired but it's late and i gotta clean up this mess of laundry and hop in the shower and get in bed and get ready for work and get the kids ready for school tomorrow but be blessed you too and until next time bye